Hello everyone, I'm Alira, and welcome to Bonnie's Bakery, where you serve tasty treats and nothing else. Start fresh. Bonnie sweeps the f the oh oh I'm in the way of the text oh well I can read Bonnie sweeps the floor and dusts the windows today is going to be another big day customers are already making a line outside of her bakery she opens the door and they all scamper in she looks at the crowd with a warm smile the raccoon a regular customer pops out of the crowd and gives Bonnie a friendly pat on the back hey Bonnie old friend I'd like to bake one of your famous red velvet cakes for an event coming up you wouldn't mind sharing the recipe with little old me now would you <laughs> oh, Bear, you, you're so silly. A Master Chef never reveals her secret recipe. The two laugh heartily. Alrighty then, I'll stop bothering you. Just like that, Bear sits down with the rest of the customers. Phew, looks like it's time to get baking. Welcome to Bonnie's Bakery. Help Bonnie serve her hungry customers by serving up some tasty pastries. Oh, I see Bear has already sat down. Hmm. Let's see what he wants today. Oh, red velvet cake, what a good choice. Alright, All right, let's start baking then. I should click on the prep station to bring it up. Um, oh dear, how do I make red velvet again? Okay. <laughs> I should check my recipe book. That's fine. All right. Oh, here we are. Hmm. Let's see. I can flip through the pages by clicking the right and left arrows. Once I find the recipe I'm looking for, I should be able to click on it and look at it while okay. baking. And if I want to put the page back, I can just click the recipe again. This time, though, uh-oh. I'm just gonna keep the recipe up. Can I move the window? Um. That's not the red velvet recipe. Next. Great. Now that I have the recipe up, I can click on the ingredients I need to put them in the mixer. So I need... Uh, sh flour, sugar... Milk, eggs, red, and fat. Now to mix it. Okay. okay, now we can pour the batter into the cake tin. Now then. And now to bake it. Oh wow, okay. that looks so good. Okay, time to click on bear and hand this over. Yay, another customer well served. It's a good thing Bear is the first customer so I could serve him first. I know a lot of customers run out of patience. Well, the day's just getting started. Time to really get to work. See you later, Bear. Oh, I can probably make some other things while I'm waiting for customers. Let's see. I can just drop what I make on one of those plates and serve it for later. Okay. I guess I'll just make something random for now. And if I make a mistake, I can just click the trash can to reset the station. Or if I put the wrong ingredients in the mixer, I can just hit the mix button to reset them. Now Off to the prep station. Okay. I'll just do white donuts. So, egg. Did it that looks so cute okay. that, oh my that was quick uh, oh dear it looks like they wanted a meat bun okay. i'll go make that now a meat bun all the way at the back okay so i need flour milk eggs What? Oh. That makes sense. There you go, sorry for the wait. Alright, All right, let's keep this up. Oh. Uh. You want the croissant? It's the first thing. Well, I lied, it's the third pastry. Uh, I need flour, sugar, and fat. Mix, cutting board, roll into pastry, put fat on it, bake an oven. There you go. You want a donut? I think I already have that. Yeah. 
you want a meat bun. Um, I think that was flour and sugar. Fat? No. <laughs> flour. Like that. Easy. There you go. Hello, squirrel. Donut. Uh. No, I was right. I'm so dumb. There we go. I'm silly. There you go. You want meat bun. I can do meat bun. That, that, and then milk, I think. I honestly can't remember. Here comes the lunch rush. Time to get serious. Uh oh. Uh, meat bun. That goes first. Uh. I didn't even need the recipe. Cause I'm a gamer. Happy. Score 88. You want a donut? I can't actually remember that. Velvet cake. Mm. Pastry. Yeah, that's probably the easiest one to make. Pastry. I actually don't remember. Oh no, meat bun, I know. Two? Who, you, got, you get it first, because you were here first. Pastry, you get that. Pastry, pastry, pastry. Pastry. Uh. I'm looking at all the stuff and I get confused easily. Red velvet. Two donuts. You and then meat bun. I forget. Oh god, the ro this this is gonna kill me. Oh, oh my memory isn't good.
Three. I can't remember, bro. I, it's it's such. <laughs> it's sugar, flour, and fat. Okay. This music is not helping me in the slightest. Why is everybody wanting a pastry now all of a sudden? Go get. I, 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 oh. oh, velvet. Okay, that's easy. There we go. There you are. All done. Wow, great work out there today, Bonnie. I bet you're gonna need a lot more ingredients to feed all these hungry customers. Aw, you're too kind. I'm glad you opened the bakery. It's nice to have a place to relax and take my mind off of things. I never knew we lived in such a dangerous neighborhood. It's so scary. People are disappearing without a trace, almost as if they've been erased. It's definitely been scary. Stay safe out there, Bear. You too, Bonnie. See you around. Bye. Of course. Bear leaves as Bonnie cleans up the bakery. Now then. Now then. It's been a busy day. <laughs> Time to get some fresh ingredients. I like this game. Oh! That's where all of the disappearances have gone. We're lucky. It looks like she took someone else for now. You. You can still move. Take your chance while she's distracted with the other one. Don't look so grim, especially since you have a chance to escape. You're so fresh. You still have all your wits about you. Among other things, listen to me. Find Bonnie's notes and save yourself. She's hidden the key code, but if you can decipher it, you can escape through the door. Use WASD to move and those fresh legs of yours to sprint with shift. Don't let her see you. Don't let her hear you. If she sees you, come back here. Bonnie's much kinder to the compliant ones. Oh. Can I move it? I'm good, I'm a good, I'm a good, I'm a good prisoner. I'm a good prisoner. I'm a good, I want to get eaten by other people. I clearly, I totally want to get eaten by other people. I know where she gets all the fat from now. And the meat. Uh, <laughs> no, wait! I'm good. I'm a good prisoner. See? 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 Oh my god. Oh. I thought this would be a cute little game. Obviously, I read the text saying that oh, this is it's just a cute little game. Okay, I'll read them all in order. Or she probably went to the right. It's a big piece of meat. If she's got all this meat, why does she keep going out and kidnapping the poor, helpless animals? No, what about the foxes? 
This makes me sad. What? Sorry. You terrible monster. Oh my goodness gracious. See, look, I'm compliant. Look at me, I'm compliant. Look at me, no need to chop me up. I'm a good, I'm good. Oh my goodness gracious. See, look at me, I'm compliant. Dude, what? Hey, now, no need for this. I'm compliant, tee hee, ha ha. Oh, Panda, help me. Compliant prisoner, as far as you're aware, nerd. Never mind. I do not wish to die today. Big old piece of meat. So she catches you. And I'm missing that last piece of note. That last note. Piece. Bro, what are you mad about? What did I do? I didn't do nothing. Look, look, look. I'm good. I'm a good complaint. I look, 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 look. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. We're good. We're good here. I didn't know what to do. So. I'm good. We're lucky. It looks like she, she. Oh. I didn't know what to do. Oh. I should have read all the notes after getting them all. Okay, whatever. The first day I opened the bakery was the happiest day of my life. I was nervous that there wouldn't be any customers, but one person came in to eat. It looked like they didn't enjoy what I made, but maybe that's just the nerves talking. Yeah, it's just the nerves. It's been two weeks since I opened the bakery. I had to restock the pantry with eggs today. I bought a whole crate for just $7. What a steal. Sadly, no one came in to eat. I guess the townsfolk don't really like my pastries. Three weeks and not a single customer. I'm going to have to close down at this rate. No one is interested in my baking, so why should I even bother? Someone knocked on the door and it was a bunny with eight terrible injuries. I let her stay inside my bakery to rest. Week four of having the bakery and things aren't getting better. That poor bunny, I spent one hour trying to heal the injuries, but it's only getting worse. She keeps getting more and more anxious. I'm trying my best, but it's not enough. I hope she can get better soon. I'm going to keep trying. I didn't know what to do. It's been five weeks now I decided to open the bakery after a customer walked into my shop and asked what that wonderful smell was. The only things I prepared today were the buns. He called in one other friend to eat at my bakery. They enjoyed the buns so much he said that he'd tell more people about my establishment. Yes, my dream is finally coming true. So let's see. One. Seven. Eight. One. One. One seven eight one one one. Right? One seven eight one one. One seven eight one one. One seven eight one one. Bruh. Panda, I'm sorry. I gotta leave you. It's been a great journey being 
held prisoner against my own free will. But now I'm going to use said free will and I'm gonna skedaddle. I'm good, I'm done, I'm out. It's been so long since you've escaped from that hellish place. What you've seen, what you've heard, it all haunts you. You want to show the townsfolk who Bonnie truly is, but you don't have any evidence that can impact her shining reputation. That day you failed to notice that she, that the notes you had collected were scattered in the wind as you ran away in fear. You could try to break into that bakery and steal enough evidence to convince the townsfolk, but you doubt that Bonnie would let that happen so easily, especially since she knows that someone has escaped. You now live within the most hidden place of the town, keeping an eye on that monster. You know that the best way to get evidence is by catching her in the act of gathering ingredients. You grip your camera tightly, waiting for the moment, to moment she strikes. Ending three of the hive. Waiting. Ending three of five? What? There's more endings. There's five endings? Okay. Let Slutter catch me. Oh! That was brutal. Right in the neck. Bonnie sweeps the floor and dusts the windows. Today is going to be another big day. Customers are already making a line outside of her bakery. She opens the door and they all scamper in. She looks at the crowd with a warm smile. A regular customer pops out of the crowd and gives Bonnie a friendly pat on the back. Hey Bonnie, old friend, since you can't really give me the recipe to your cake, how about you make one for me to take home? A cake for you to take home? Hmm, I've never thought of doing takeouts before. That sounds like a good idea. Yes, Bear, I'll bake you a red velvet cake to take home. And you know what? Since you're my number one customer, I'll use my freshest ingredients to make that cake. Oh no. I'm the fresh ingredients. One out of five fresh ingredients. I got- okay, so wait, I- I'm so lost and or confused. We're lucky, it looks like she took someone else for now. You, you can still move, take your chance while she's distracted with the other one. Don't look so grim, especially since you have a chance to escape, you're so fresh, you still have your- I don't care. Alright, so, um... I see some changes here that I haven't seen here before. Like you, you're new. Oh, here she's coming back. So, um, I've always managed to get a score at least above a thousand when cooking in the first part. Because I thought I had to get a high score for a different ending. I didn't know I think I needed a low score. I also don't remember though some of these NPCs nearby. I just don't understand. I, am I just too cracked in the kitchen? Am I too goated? Why are you there? I don't get it. I just don't get it. Panda, explain this to me. Alright. What are you doing in here? Actually, I'm not surprised. You were always doing weird things around the bakery. I guess you had the right idea all along. I'm sorry. Okay, bye bye You escape from Bonnie's bakery, finally free from that horrifying place. Nothing can erase those terrible smells and screams from your memories. Nothing. You grip the notes you collected tightly in your hands. You could use this. They were precious. Bonnie, after a rather successful day at the bakery, hummed to herself. Since she had such a good haul today, she decided to take it easy on tomorrow's prep work. You go to tell the townsfolk about Bonnie's crimes. At first, they were unwilling to listen to you, but then you reveal the damning evidence that had helped you escape in the first place. <gasps> the townsfolk were shocked to hear your tale. Some were in denial, while the others trembled in fear. How could it be? The food they had been eating all this time. As the townsfolk drew closer to the bakery, Bonnie realized she was done for. With no time to clean, she instead made a hasty escape. 
The mob surrounded the bakery, demanding Bonnie to reveal herself. They broke down the door, and their eyes scanned the interior with ba batted breaths. They searched the bakery from head to toe, but found no one. Only the evidence of her crimes had remained. Bonnie was gone and never seen again. Ending two out of five. Escape. Okay, time to go. I'm out. I'm out again. You escape from Bonnie's bakery, finally free from that horrifying place. Nothing can erase those terrible smells and screams from your memories. Nothing. You go to tell the townsfolk about Bonnie's crimes, and as you dashed away, you ran with such fear and vigor that you failed to notice that the notes you had collected were slipping away into the wind. Bonnie watched you carefully from within her bakery as you sprinted away too quickly for her to give chase. After an annoyingly slow day, Bonnie had swiftly taken care of the rest of her ingredients. She always felt better with a clean basement, after all. She disappeared quickly into the cellar to finish the job and clear her mind. You, on the other hand, would not have as much luck finding peace. Hmm, I don't know. That doesn't sound like something Bonnie would do. Yeah, is this a prank or something? You're seriously saying this stuff again? This is the last straw. The townsfolk ignore your plea. No one believes you, and some even call you a liar. Ever since that day, you live in fear and paranoia. You live alone now, far away from that cursed town. But even though you've already thrown your old life away, you always have an aching suspicion that someone is watching you. Ending four out of five. Fear. Oh, wow, that's crazy. Look, Bonnie's on the other side of my window, staring at me because I know her secret, but no one will believe me. So what's the point of keeping me alive? Ah, what is this? What did I do? Ending five out of five. Bingus. Oh, she got she got a little animation on the right side. Whoops, sorry, my I I blocked it, but she she got she did the thing. Bingus. Bonus Beijery. WASD client is a victim of food poisoning and Bongi is prescribed for poison for everyone that bakery is now closed because it is what is that not up to code retry meat buns bad animal disease definition absolute nonsense example this is preposterous absolute pronunciation guide toys nigoi silnir or si Toys is that what Doodle Bob says? Hold on, Bingus. Also two. There's a two. That's gotta have something to do with something, right? There's a two there. I I suspect that has something important. Five. I didn't see that. I didn't see those numbers. So these endings. There's okay. So it's it's set up like the papers are, or the middle one's a question mark. Um, each ending has a different number, so I'm going to assume there are five numbers that I need for that secret ending. So the first one is five, the one was one, let's see what this one is. Ending three out of five, waiting. Five, one, is it gonna show up? Five, one, three. Five, one, three. Five, one, three, two, two. That's awkward. We both met up at the door. <laughs> the sounds of me slapping. Five, one, three, two, two. That was the code. Okay, why why is that there? 
Hello, you monster. It's me, the guy. Yeah. We're getting Panda out of there. You grab the limbless bear with you as you finally open the door. The smell of must and blood wafts throughout the bakery from that cursed room. Thank you, muttered the bear weakly. The townsfolk were shocked to hear your tale. Some were in denial while the others trembled in fear. How could it be the food they had been eating all this time is the townsfolk escort you and the injured bear to a hospital. You sigh relieved that this is all finally over as the injured bear finally slumbers comfortably. You look outside of the window to see a gathering of townsfolk. A large group is going to investigate Bonnie's bakery to see the aftermath of, the, of everything. Secret end. Free. Secret ending. Alright, so we've gotten all the endings, right? So let me go check them out, just to make sure- oh, well, um... I know this game came out like six months ago, and I've heard that they've updated the game quite a bit and changed some stuff, so I'm not really sure what to expect. But there is that knife there that I know I haven't seen there before. <clears throat> the ingredients are running low. All right. Looks like it's time for... What is it time for? Ah, I see. It's anime time. Bonnie to make an appearance. All right, time to head out. I've got a few potential ingredients here on my list. It's hard being so popular after all. So many people have their eyes on me. I can feel them watching me. Constant watching. I understand how they feel. They're jealous because the bakery's been doing so well. But you can't be following me around like that, silly ingredients. Now, who to pick? Ah. Maybe Bonnie's bakery DLC coming soon. Nice. So maybe for the DLC that's upcoming, either we're going to be playing as Bonnie and we're going to go hunt down the uh, potential ingredients. And this might be before the main character. I don't know which... Hmm, that's crazy. I don't really know what ending they would be going off on or what the canon ending would be because there's five different endings with a, a secret ending. So I'm not really sure if the next if the DLC is gonna end off start off where the one of the endings happen probably not and it's gonna ha and it, it's probably gonna take off right before any of the endings happen and at all well everyone that was Bonnie's Bakery and I'm Alira I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did apparently it's getting DLC too along the way so I'm definitely gonna be looking out for that and I definitely can't wait to see more of this game that was very cute well the beginning part was cute not the not the latter but that besides the point um i hope you all have a great rest of your day <laughs> goodbye